friends and welcome back to my channel. This is me, Bridget, where I'm bringing you all things fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. So as you can see, Tims, we are back where? In my closet. <laughs> so in today's video, I have a very special treat for you because guess what I did over the weekend? I went thrifting. I went thrifting. And I'm not going to spoil it for you. So I'm going to put in this footage right here of me going to the thrift store. And then we are going to come back and I'm going to show you everything that I copped. So let's get into the video. What's up, my Tim? So as you saw in the intro, I wanted to take you guys uh, thrifting with me. Um, I got a, an email from Diva Resale and I, you saw some previous videos that I got a lot of stuff from Diva before. They're having a garage sale and everything is one dollar. So I could not pass this up. It's about 2.30 and they're here until 4. So I'm going to see what I can find and I'm purposely only taking $25. So 26. You can get 26 items. That's enough. Um, so I won't take you know my whole wallet and spend any more than that um and i parked kind of far so <laughs> even if i wanted to get some money i would have to walk back so yeah so let's go on this journey of me thrifting and see what i can find all right so this is literally a garage sale as you can see um designer diva they moved their location they have tents and everything up i hope you guys can hear me because i have the mask on but uh hopefully I can find some good stuff out here um yeah so i'm walking up right now um so yeah let's we'll see what i can find what's up my tim so so far i have found four items i found this little cute dress now as you know when i style stuff i style it differently so i found this i found this top right here i love a good polka dot black and white top and i found this cute little skirt you know I love a short skirt, but it has pockets. So that's what I love, because it has pockets in it. And then I found these pants, and I like a wide-legged pant. So the pant leg is very wide. So yeah, I'm excited. So uh, I will show you guys everything that I found. You know, I always take stuff to the cleaners whenever um, I thrift stuff. And then I will show you in another video how I styled everything. I'm gonna do some more shopping. I don't wanna show you everything because when I get back, I'll show you everything that I got. And then I'll do another video on how I style all of my thrifting stuff. So stay tuned. Okay guys, so I wanted to tell you real quick, when you're at a, a thrift store or garage sale and you come across something that you really like, like this two piece right here, I'm not a fan of the skirt, but look at the detailing on the jacket. The red buttons here and the red buttons and the, look at that. That is some great detailing there. And so, I'm going to get this because plus it's only a dollar. I mean, come on. And then, you know, maybe I'll find another use for the skirt. I mean, the skirt's okay, but it's not really something that I would wear. But this jacket, I can style this jacket <clears throat> with some jeans and, you know, I like jumpers. So I'm excited about the jacket. But I just wanted to tell you, don't pass up a great find if you don't like the whole thing. Get it, style the piece that you like, and then just discard the other part or give it away. So just a little tidbit. Okay guys, I just finished and I'm so proud of myself. I stayed within my budget. Uh, I ended up spending $24. Remember I told you I took $26. Um, so now I have to back my car up in there and I found four pairs of shoes. I'm so excited to show you guys what I got. Yeah, so this was worth it. Anyway, I'll see you soon. Okay, my Tim. So, yes, I had a bunch of fun and I found 20 items, like I said, and four pairs of shoes. One pair I have on right now, but I'll show you the shoes uh, last. So, here, you can see behind me, or maybe you can't. Hold on. Let me switch sides. Maybe you can see this way. Okay. So, here, I have two plastic covers, clothes, full of clothes, okay? 10 on this side, 10 on this side. So, I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna show you each piece kind of quickly and then I want to do another video with how you know I kind of style some things I may show you some some different things that you can do with a couple of the things that I found that I instantly thought of that I could do so 
let's get into me showing you all the items that I got. Okay, my Tim, so I had to do this aesthetically to maneuver around uh, a little bit better so I can show you everything. Okay, so the first item is this vest. I love this. Now remember, all of these items were $1. So when I saw this, I was like, hmm. You know, I, I like how it, um, see the buttons are here on the inside. And so um, you can put a shirt on under this. Uh, I'll wear another jacket over it and just the vest by itself. So yeah, I really like this. And I may like, you know, pull it in to taper it, you know, if I wear it with a jacket so it can be a little bit tighter to my body. Or, you know, if I choose to wear it by itself, or I might even belt it, who knows? But that's just some ideas that you can use wearing this item. Okay, so as you know, we live in Houston, Texas, and the weather here, I mean, you can wake up in the morning and it's freezing cold, by the afternoon it's hot, and then in the evening it's cold again. So usually you kind of have to layer up. However, I wanted to prepare for the more warmer months. However, you can wear shorts in the winter time as well. Now, I like these because of this little detailing right here. I like the little flap here. And these are by uh, Ann Taylor, guys. Look at this. Ann Taylor, okay? One dollar, right? So you know that these are good quality clothes, and that's another thing. They always have very good quality clothes there that you can find. So, yeah. And I love a good pocket. These have pockets. Yeah, they do. Yeah. So the pockets are still, uh, what do you call it? Sewn together, which I like to unsew or uh, do pockets. So yeah. So there's the pocket on here. And this is like a blue black uh, pair of shorts. Still has a tag on them. However, I'm still taking it to the queens. <laughs> okay. So yeah, I kind of went on this short thing. So here's another pair of shorts that I cop. And I like these because of the kind of the, the ribbing detail. I'm a sucker for details, guys. So see this right here? I love the ribbing of this detail. And these are by White House Black Market. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, White House Black Market. And these two have the little pockets here, you know, on the side. So I'm a sucker for detailing and I'm a sucker for pockets. <laughs> now, there was a time where I used to wear black everything all the time. Now I've come into adding color into my life. So I love this little blouse. You know, I love color. And here's like, you know, the button over here. Where you can, you know, do it as a short sleeve. And then I like how the sleeve kind of, you know, curves here. It's not just a straight um, seam across. And it's beautiful with the blue and the green. And look how that good that looks up against my skin, y'all. See that? Yes. So this, again, only a dollar. And this is by Talbot's. Listen, name brand, stuff, one dollar. <laughs> now, this next piece. So shout out to Miss Brenda and Miss Sheila. If you ladies are watching this, I know it took me a minute to get this video out. But these ladies were hilarious. And another young lady that I met, I forgot your name, but shout out to you two. Um, we just had an amazing time. And Miss Brenda and Miss Sheila actually picked out a couple of things for me. One of the pairs of shoes and this, uh, some dresses. But I found, I saw this dress and then they were like, you should get that. And so this is a nice, uh, you know, spring brunch dress, honey. I love a good brunch. You know, and this is something that I would style with. So dresses like this, I'll put a shirt underneath here or wear it with a nice jacket or sometimes by itself. But nine times out of 10, you know, I'll put a cute shirt with it and um, I like it. Listen, I'm looking to see if there were pockets. I thought it was pockets. There are no pockets, but that's okay because I really like the dress and, uh, you know, Miss Brenda and Miss Sheila just kind of encouraged me to get it. And this is by Nicole Miller. See that? Nicole Miller. Nicole Miller Studio. One dollar. And it's 100% silk. One dollar. Man, I racked up. <laughs> now, I love a good top or blouse that, you know, has stripes and colors. And this is a pink and red and black and white top. And it is 
by Jones, New York signature. I don't know if you can see that. Jones, New York. Jones, New York. One dollar. And it's 100% cotton. Very nice and heavy, but white. Really cute. This could go under, you know, I love jumpers. I would put this under a jumper. That's a different color that, you know, maybe would stick out. Uh, and then put a jacket on with it and then it would look like I have on like a three-piece suit or something like that. But I love, love, love tops that have stripes, designs, and everything also in them. Now, as I said, you know, we live in Houston and so this is just a, a black sweater. However, I love it. It's ribbed, kind of like this one, you know. Oh, by the way, this sweater I got from Design and Diva's last garage shell, sale and it was $2. Look at this beautiful isn't it i love the puff of like a victorian sleeve that is see it's very straight here and then it puffs out here anyway i digress so this sweater is by newport news I'm telling you only a dollar and it's 75 percent silk 23 percent nylon and two percent spandex nice little sweater you know and with this you know like for example i would probably take this top right here put it underneath and because it has this little scoop neck you know you could see this part of the top and then maybe some red slacks a red skirt who knows I don't know child but I'll show you okay now I had a vision for these guys so <laughs> these are like regular uh I don't know, I guess they just call them culottes. I don't know if these are culottes or gauchos or whatever we used to call them in the past, but these are going to be very big on me. However, I kind of like that slouch look. And if I have to, you know, I can cinch it, you know, at the waist or something and then put on a cute little um, top or whatever. Um, I don't know who Liz and me is. I, I, is that a maternity? <laughs> Could I fool around and buy some maternity pants? Oh no. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to make it work. But uh, they, they are going to be very big because they are a uh, a 1X, I think, 18 to 20. And so, yeah. But I'm looking forward to it because as I was shopping, sorry, something in my eye. As I was shopping, I had an idea in my head of how I was going to style it. So I'll show you. <laughs> okay, and here's that jacket that I showed you in the video earlier. Look at the detailing. Look at that embroidery there, here, and then the buttons that they have, the red buttons. I love a good contrast. Here are buttons on the sleeve, and then how they have the embroidery on the pocket and the button as well. I love this. Like I said, the skirt, I'm not a fan of, you know what I mean? I don't know what I'm going to do with the skirt. I may keep it and style it or I may, you know, give it away. But this jacket, honey, I have plans for this jacket. <laughs> okay, now, th this is the first part of the first 10 items. So this is this red wool jacket. Now, this attracted my eye because of these buttons. I told you, I'm a sucker for hardware. I'm a sucker for the detailing. And... Like I need another red jacket. Like I need another hole in my head. Look at this. Red jacket. <laughs> and I like this one because of the, the black button here and then the black buttons on the sleeve. That's what got me with this one, okay? This red jacket, see I told you like I need another red jacket, like I need another hole in my head. I like this red jacket because of the white buttons on the jacket and it's double breasted and then the white buttons down on the sleeve. Yeah, I know. Red. My favorite color. I just told you guys that in 50 Things About Me, red and pink are my two favorite colors. Okay? <laughs> okay, guys. So, I decided to keep this video from being too, too long. I'm going to do a part two to show you the second half of the items that I got. And, uh... And I promise I'll show you the shoes in the second one as well. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video so far. Please, please remember to subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell, and leave a comment down below if it's something that you like or if you're a thrifter as well. And um, stay tuned to part two of my thrifting shopping video in my closet because this is going to go into the closet edition. Anyway, guys, as per usual, I hope you are having an amazing day. Peace mwah, and love.
Bye. Every single day, I'm gonna make